All right, DeMeso back at it again, this time with version 5. One of the biggest differences here is he now has the open bore or open BOR game set up on here. And then he's cleaned it up quite a bit, updated it all, it's running a great theme. And uh, he's been an image creator now for a long time, so, you know, he's made some great images. He tends to um, put a lot of, yeah, the collections like Batman. He loves fighter games, wrestling games, things of that sort. So you see a lot more collections and things like that, custom collections here. You have his own DeMeso Picks, Neo Geo Mini. So all the games that uh, would be on the Neo Geo, that's something new that hasn't been on the previous builds because we just got the Neo Geo Mini not too long ago. But that's there. And uh, all games rocking 6,400 games on a 32 gigabyte. But there's some really nice games on here. This isn't one of those uh, dump a whole ROM pack. You know, you'll notice Game Game Boy Advance only has 59 games, not 1,000 games. Um, but it still has a nice arcade set. It only has seven in 64 games compared to a lot more that some of these other images have. So um, if you like his work in the past, you're probably going to like this one all up to date. So let's go ahead and take a deeper look. So on first boot, it should prompt you to set up your controls. Go ahead and hold down your button. I have afterglow, up, down, left, right, start, select, A, B, X, Y, left, right. You'll notice I messed up here. This is not defined, whoops. Go ahead and finish all the rest. I use select for my hotkey and then just use your D-pad to go back up and then just go back through here. Just click A, click what you want. Go down to right trigger, click A, click what you want. Sometimes it's just a little finicky, but as you see, easy, easy go easily done uh, a little bit of warning too when you boot up this image there is a picture of a woman wearing lingerie so no nudity but do know that if you want to take that off just go to your splash screen there's a little splash screens thing right there on the RetroPie setup you could get rid of it or switch it out on your own and as far as background music I didn't see a background music script button on RetroPie but you could just go to the file manager here with a keyboard go to RetroPie go to ROMs go to music and then you can either add your own music delete this music um, delete all of it so there's just no music I just deleted it really quick F8 on my keyboard yes I want to delete F10 to quit and then you have to reboot your Pi and that'll turn off the music um, it's got some hip-hop instrumentals some things like that to, to get started but now uh, let's get into it all right when you download the file it's gonna be 28.4 gigabytes that's 30 billion 562 million 853 this is round up 54,000 bytes and uh, I'm I'm running it on a SanDisk uh, no, I'm sorry, I'm running it on a Samsung 32 gigabyte um, Samsung, not the Select, but the, um, which is this one called? The, the Plus, the Plus, Plus, Plus. And those tend to have a lot more available space on them. Uh, some people say that this they have a little bit more issues fitting this on some of those, you know, if you get an off-brand 32 gigabyte or some other one. So it's running 4.4.2. So as I mentioned, it's fully updated. Um, it prompts you for your controllers to start. You can turn off that music like I showed you. It does have Easy Hacks Toolkit installed. Also has the Auto Amiga. Um, and then other than that, it's pretty it's pretty straightforward. So let's go just go ahead and have a look what we have here. Sega 32x31. So not it's missing about five of those games, but again, he doesn't just throw everything in there. Sega CD 14 games. So again, doesn't just throw everything in there. As I mentioned, he's a fan of wrestling. Batman, things like that. So you're going to see all those games. SG-1000, 68. Super Nintendo, 900. So I think you should see some hacks in here, potentially. Or some... Uh, there also might be some other games in here. You have to... Yeah, here you go. You got a, a Back to Classic custom music version. So there, there will be some other... Games that you don't necessarily find on all the other images. Vetrix, 21. Virtual Boy, 19. Wonderswan Color, 19. So this is a collection. So this is just going to have all your Batman games. And uh, something Recall or RetroPie brought out a while ago is they label the ROM. So this is the SNES version of Batman Forever. This is the Mega Drive, also known as Sega Genesis version. This is the Game Boy version. Um, Atari Lynx version. Uh, Mega Drive. Uh, okay, that where that's Batman Returns vs. Forever. And then you get the Sega CD version, the Amiga version. So it's pretty cool um, that it's easy to organize and it's all good to go. Um, that's something else that we may take for granted is that, you know, his images, he went through all the names here. I mean, look at that. You don't have any misspellings. You have all the metadata here. You have all the photos. Um, looks like there are no video snaps. This is just JPEGs. He's not messing around with any of the, the bling. Family computer system, 115 games. 
uh, Genesis hacks. So this is cool. He does have them separated in hacks. So on Genesis, you have some hacks. And again, there's a lot of these hacks. And it looks like he's not just throwing them all in there. King of Fighters, 14 of those. Mostly Neo Geo, but a couple other systems. Mortal Kombat, all the Mortal Kombat games. One through four. Um, doesn't have any of the new ones. Like, as the P PlayStation version. And there's a hack version. And the main version. Uh, Nintendo hacks. Quite a bit here, actually. D-pad hero. This game's actually kind of cool. You just, you know, if you really, if you want to get good with your controller. Uh, God of War for NES. Mega Man. Pepsi Man. Um, a lot of cool, fun games in here. PC Engine CD-ROM. You got Castlevania. Super Famicom. So you got quite a few of those. Some fun ones to play. Super Nintendo hacks. So Chrono, Tri Chrono Trigger. Earthbound Halloween. Uh, different Mario's. There's some Zelda hacks as well that are fun to play. Legend of Zelda BS, Legend of Zelda Cube, Wario Land. Street Fighter. I know there's a lot of Street Fighter fans out there. So Street Fighter Alpha 1, 2, and 3. SNES version, Championship Edition version, the movie version. Uh, you got Super Gem Fighters. A lot of fun stuff there. Oh, you even got SVC Chaos for Neo Geo. Super graphics, pretty typical five wrestling games. This is what I said. He, I, I mean, it's my understanding he loves wrestling. So if you guys like wrestling games, look no further. Um, I don't believe he puts all the Nintendo 64 versions on here because they, you know, a lot of people, you got No Mercy. Um, there's a lot of wrestling games. There's a few wrestling for Nintendo 64 that don't work. But there you go. It has about two or three of the N64 versions. And there's about six total, I think, for Nintendo 64. All right, so we took this this before. We'll play with some picks later when we test some games out. All games, we talked about that. Amiga 99, so good to see some Amiga love. Some of, you know, these are all kind of the 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 best or if you, more popular, if you will, games. And uh, I always see on the forums people say, you know, why do these people have 10,000 game collections? They never have enough time to play them all. And you'd be right. So, you know, images like this are cool because... You can play some of your favorite backups, and you have a little bit less to choose from. You don't have that choice overload because, right, it's like, where do I start? Here, you're still going to have that problem, but just a little bit less of it. Okay, Atari 2600, 505, 7861, Atari Lynx 85, Coley, Co, Vision 140, Dreamcast, you get just one, Marvel vs. Capcom 2, which does run on the Raspberry Pi 3B+. That's what I'm running on right now. Final Burn Alpha 127. So this is going to be all your Capcom CPS system 1, 2, and 3. Uh, family computer disk system 144. Game & Watch 54. Game Gear. We're going to get in some portables here. 228. 505 on Game Boy. Game Boy Advance 59. If you're wondering what 59 of those are. So obviously Castlevania, Batman, wrestling games, Mario games, Mega Man games, Metroid games, Mortal Kombat games, Pokemon games. So more of kind of the best sellers as I was mentioning earlier. Game Boy Color 451, MAME 665, Sega Master System 143, Sega Genesis 725. So it is Genesis, not Mega Drive on here. But if you want to change it to Mega Drive, it's very easy to do with using that Easy Hacks Toolkit. Seven Nintendo 64 games. All these games run really well on the Pi. Neo Geo, all of them. Nintendo, all of them, plus some hacks. Neo Geo Pocket 6, Color 37, TurboGrafx 16, 145. Let's see what kind of ports we have on our Doom 1, Doom 2. Two, and then we have open bore. I'll play with that in just a second. I want to see, does it have its own category? Or do you have to get through it through there? All right, my man. 321 Super Crash. Great game. Uh, the Terminator is a fun little game. I was playing that the other day. So a few PSP games that are worthy, worthy of a play. PlayStation where, you know, this is another good example. PSP minis, there's like over 200. And if you're not, you're not going to, you can only play so many games of Mahjong you know, uh, as you can, I, I may have mispronounced that, but you know what game I'm talking about, the little uh, Domino's game. Okay, uh, PlayStation, not too many. Again, this is only a 32 gigabyte image, so you can't you can't load them all up on there. Uh, and then we're back at 32X. I did want to see, does this open another folder? Okay, no. So it opens the emulator, and then once you're in the emulator, you now can uh, pick the games you want. So... There you go. Some beats. So open bore. Beats of Rage is on there. Streets of Rage 2. The Simpsons Treehouse Terror. 
and this isn't perfect you do have to go in a game and then uh potentially change the controls once you're in the game okay so it works with the keyboard hooked up i'm having no issues whatsoever just use up down left right and then a to attack okay and you have to mess a little bit more with that. So this is a it's this is a uh, exper experimental core. So you're gonna have to uh, play around a little bit to get it working. But fun little game, some new levels to try out. All right, escape quits or F10, and there you go. All right, Doom One, Doom Two are on there as well. All right, so you've seen me play Super Crash. You played a lot of PlayStation games. We wanted to play, oh, his picks. Let's go ahead and check out his picks. Custom collection, his picks. Alien vs. Predator, you've seen me play that before. Let's do a little bit of Arch Riot. Oh, that's the basketball. There's a lot of sports game on this image as well. Blade to Steel, awesome game. Cadillacs and Dinosaurs, awesome game. Let's do a little Power Instinct for the Neo Geo. So that's cool. He does have custom launch screens for some of the games. So there's a little bling on here. Also has some bezels. Me random. Oh, we got a mirror matchup here. Ooh, Grandpa just wrecked you. Ooh, give him the clock, clock, comment. There you go. Ooh, throw it, it was teeth again. Nice. Ooh. I remember that move. Ooh, that was good. He does like a Blanca thing. There we go. Now I got you on fire this time. Ooh. Whoa, jump, 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 jump. Oh, man. You gotta block it, I guess. This is not looking good. Can't take another hit. We got a corner. Oh, he got me. Knocked out. Sliding on him. I wonder if I can just slide. Just keep sliding. Now let's throw your dentures. Throw your dentures. There you go. Ooh. I didn't know I could even do that. Throw your dentures at him. Or do that little block. Nice. There we go. Hadouken. Ooh, okay. Gotta play a little smarter here. Ooh, okay. Smarter here. We're gonna throw our dentures at him when he's not expecting it. Ooh. There we go. Ooh. It's a close game. Alright, just keep blocking. Nice. Who won? Oh, man. Okay, so cool little game, Puzzle Bobble, awesome game, awesome puzzle game. I'm sure you guys don't want to watch that. Uh, Road Fighter, fun little game, racing racing game with some guns involved, Sunset Riders. So a lot of good arcade picks here if you're into arcade games. Um, great game as well, Super Mario Land 2. Can't play a lot of, uh, a lot of uh, Nintendo games because they copyright like Crazy. Looney Tunes, No Mercy. We can, um, you guys all seen that before. Yoshi Cookie, you've seen before. Let's try WDF No Mercy. I think a lot of people are always interested in how Nintendo 64 performs. And I mean, it's not going to be perfect. 
but you'll see it it's it'll be it should be playable and a lot of these wrestling games when i tested them back in the day before we even had the raspberry pi 3b plus the main issue was just uh the menu system Exhibition. I can tell you right now, it's running pretty dang hard. Pretty dang good. You see the rock versus Triple H. Starts like down there, running really good. That seems pretty optimized the way he has it set up. So, really cool. All right, so there you have it, Demeso version five. I'm gonna have to give this one an A. I mean, especially if you know what you're getting into. It's not like all the bells and whistles and all that stuff, but it's just a really well-rounded image with somebody who knows what he likes, and you might like the same things as him. So, therefore, if you're going after something similar as you saw, you know, sports, Batman. It's it's sports superhero games fighter games and Castlevania um, and then some puzzle and adventure games as well like uh, you'll notice some slight emphasis on that um, but if you're really into that he kind of highlights the best of the best but he still gives you a ton um, but it's nice to see that it has kind of a there's, you know there's a rhyme there's a reason behind all this and he makes it shine and with the version 5 you know that it's you know anything that's been broken with it in the past has probably been fixed updated things like that so it's nice to know that when you're trying out something like this that it's not just going to be completely broken when you, you you set it all up so with all that said gonna have to give this one an a i'm liking it let me know what you guys think don't forget to like and subscribe and we'll catch you guys on the next one